Hey everyone. This story is very recent. Most of you all know, especially if you're in middle school or high school right now, that vaping is the new trend that everybody seems to be everybody seems to be doing. Most likely, if you're still in school like I am, when people vape, they're doing it in the bathrooms. So, in my school, we have a couple bathrooms on the first and second floor. But I have one bathroom on the first floor that has an automatic button so I can get in and out of the bathroom and I have one bathroom on the second floor that has an automatic button. I had to get these buttons put in and I didn't have them my ninth grade year so I'm so grateful for them. I am limited to those two bathrooms because those are the only bathrooms with the buttons. My school decided that since everybody's vaping in the bathrooms, that if they locked the one bathroom, it might stop the problem. Realistically though, it just sent all those kids who were vaping in the bathroom that they just now locked down to the bathroom with the automatic button on it so I can get in and out. The bathroom has three stalls, including the accessible stall. And all the kids that are vaping choose to go into the accessible stall because they can fit five people, five or six people in there at a time and all vape together. So now when I go into the bathroom at school, everybody's in the stall that I need to just go to the bathroom. And since that's the only bathroom on the downstairs floor that has the button, if I really have to go and they're just gonna stay in there and vape the whole day away, then I gotta go all the way upstairs. That wasn't even the whole story. It was kind of a little bit of background to the story. So I was going to my brother's basketball game a couple weekends ago, and it was an away game at a different school. It was halftime, and I had to use the bathroom. So I went in to the bathroom and I go to the handicap accessible stall and guess what? It is locked and you can see at least four people standing in that stall by their feet on the ground. Those kids were vaping and Guess what? It was at an away game at a different school. Guess who the kids were that were vaping? The same kids that were vaping in my school. They came to the game to watch and they went to the bathroom at halftime to vape. And they used the accessible stall just like they do at school. It's extremely frustrating that people are doing this and I am not promoting vaping or saying that you should do it, but I know realistically that it is a trend and I know realistically that people follow trends. So people are going to do it no matter what you say. If you're choosing to vape, go right ahead. I'm not gonna stop you. If you are going to vape, please be mindful and do not use the handicap accessible stall 
to vape for 15 minutes straight when someone actually needs that stall to use it to go to the bathroom. That stall is not made just for you to go in and have a party with your friends and do vaping tricks. Thank you for watching. Bye.